this is Dino. Welcome to my channel. I'm back, y'all. It is like, oh, uh, 1244. And my half a bowl of cereal that I had this morning has really worn off. So I thought I would make some folders out of envelopes and have lunch with you. So I'm being good. I have very little ranch dressing over here. That's just going to be my guilty pleasure here on my journey of healthiness. Um, but anyway, I have just got a little bit of ham, some Monterey Jack cheese, and just lettuce, tomato, and cucumber. That's my lunch. Um, yeah, and water. I'm trying to do good, y'all. Trying to do good. So I'm going to get in one bite, and we'll get going. I'm very good. Mm. Okay. Excuse my crunchiness. What I am making is I've just pulled out stuff. I buy stuff and I'm going to make it. I'm going to make that. And I don't ever always use my stuff. Sometimes it stays in my stash too long. This is going to be a, a this is going to be a stash buster for you. We're just going to call it this. And this is easy pocket folders made out of envelopes, y'all. And look, I even put a pocket on the front of this one. Let's just get going. So, I have these colored envelopes. I have had them in my stash for, oh, I don't even know how long. And, um, I just said, you know what? It's time to use them. Like, I even went ahead and matted something from the front of the folder I'm going to make. And look, I used a part of the envelope just so I could use up my envelopes. And, um, it actually is going to match. So, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need two so two envelopes, whatever size you want, okay? This, these envelopes, I believe, are, these are about five and a quarter, or seven and a quarter by five and a quarter. So whatever size you have, you can make these. Super easy. And so all you're going to do is you're going to take your, take two envelopes, and you're going to put them down inside of each other and I, on the first one I did two different colors on this one I'm going to do the same color so that way then my flap is the same and I'm just going to put this down in there and I'm going to I'm going to add glue and I'm going to glue it together so I need to put some glue on the back here you can tape glue whatever you know I was sitting here I made the mask video earlier and I hope um, if anybody is watching it I hope you're enjoying it um, I just felt like playing, and as Miss Sheila says, messing. She always says, I just mess, y'all, and so, y'all, I am just gonna mess. Now, the paper that I am gonna be using, okay, let's get this in here while I got the glue, before the glue starts drying all over on me. Okay, get it all the way up in there, okay, y'all? See how that looks? Now you have this part. Now, let's glue down this back one. Okay, I'm going to move my stuff over here. This part is going to need to be glued down. Why not use envelopes as pocket folders? Why not? I, there's no reason why you shouldn't. If you've got a bunch in your stash, and I know I always have tons of kind of envelopes in my stash. It's time for another bite of this, y'all. I'm trying to do things that are low carb. I know there's a little bit of sugar and stuff in my dressing, but I did very little like a tablespoon. So, trying to keep it as healthy as I can. Trying it Saturday. Usually I go to Chick-fil-A and take my husband lunch, but today I am skipping it. Okay. Now we have it looking like this. We got a page here. So, what, we, what we're going to do, and this collection, let me just show you the collection. Super cute that I'm using on these today. This is it right here, y'all. It is a doodle bug, and it's cute and crafty. I purchased this from scrapbook.com, I don't know, about, oh, two months ago somewhere around there and I haven't used it yet and I decided you know what it's so cute let's just make something out of it and you know let's just face it we all we all do things and we all um do things buy things to make things out of so let's just make it I gotta get my water y'all 
Okay, got my big 42 ounce of water. I've already drank almost the whole thing. I'm trying to do a lot of water, eat better, and walk. That's that's my that's my life right now. That is what I'm doing. I'm doing it for me. So if you want to join me, go ahead. Sometimes, sometimes whenever you have someone else that kind of sticks with you, it helps you, you know, to you know, it helps you to be um stick with it more if you have someone that helps now miss uh, miss katrina she isn't feeling well but um and because her family have been sick but she's she's cutting out sodas and trying to you know she's trying to eat better as well and so i texted her and said you know what i'm telling you this so i will be accountable and um so she told me yesterday she has only had um, coffee and water yesterday. She's cut out sodas. So great job. Great job, Ladybug. I'm proud of you for that. Okay, so let's just get on with de decorating this. Now, I've already cut pieces for, um, for one side. Let's do the inside first. So what you're going to need is you're going to need a piece to cover this part right here up. And you won't need a whole piece to stick up underneath there. You're just gonna need it enough where it sticks right here so it covers up, because you don't wanna leave it all white. Mine is all white and it's kinda, you know, it's kinda funky, you don't want that. So I think I'm gonna use this scrap right here and I'm gonna cut cut myself a piece. And what I did is I just measured this up against my, I just measured it up the height that I want and it doesn't have to go all the way to the tip top because it's up inside the envelope. So I'm just gonna cut myself. I'm trying to see where I put my line now, y'all. You know, does that happen to y'all? You forget where you put the line or you can't see it? Oh, there it is, I see it, okay. It is right over here. I'm gonna get this cut. And this one right here, this is this piece is about oh two and a half inches. So I'm just gonna cut two and a half inches. Okay. So this is gonna be for the other the inside of our other side of our folder. So it's gonna go right up inside. And if you get it too tall like I did, just trim it down. I'm just gonna trim off, I don't know, an eighth of an inch. And got to go a little bit more. Get another bite of my salad here, y'all. What are y'all having for lunch? I hope you're trying to choose something healthy like I am. I, this is the way I'm looking at it. I am going to give myself one cheat day a week. So I can eat something that I really want. Okay, so I think that that's going to fit right up inside here really well. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to flip it around so I have a better edge. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to line my paper up right on the edge of that where the crease is. Once you get it in all in, in a spot where you want it, stick yourself some glue underneath there. And then make sure you're getting it right up close to that edge, but not on that fold, okay? Then press it down. So I'm gonna do this side for this, for this one over here. My glue. I do have an Amazon order that's supposed to come today. I'm excited. Oh, not Amazon, scrapbook.com. So, got a little glue on the outside. It's okay, I'm gonna cover it up. So, my scrapbook.com order I was told is supposed to be delivered today, so I hope it is. I will come back and show you guys. 
Okay, so see how I made it two colors on the inside. Now, this one, this one right here, I'm gonna show you how you get this piece, but I'm gonna go ahead and glue this one on. And then I'll show you how I measured and got that one. I went in my kitchen while I go to make my salad. I'm like, oh, you know, I wasn't going to do much today around the house, but I guess I need to do a little bit of something to make myself happy. And also, too, I have a nice puzzle on my table in there that I started the other night. My husband told me, are you bored? I said, no, I feel like doing a table. I feel like doing a puzzle. Y'all, y'all just go make yourself a chef salad. Just a little bit of dressing because that's, that's where the fat comes from. So, yeah, so good, so good. Okay, so I've got this piece. Let me show you how I measured that. I'm gonna take another envelope, okay? Move this one aside. So, you're gonna take your envelope and let me uh, see here. Let me get a good piece of paper. Mm. I have quite a, I ordered a couple extra pieces of this one. So maybe I'll just use this. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to measure your envelope. Measure your paper against your envelope. And I just want to make sure this is going to be enough because I have the branding strip on here. So let me rim this off and grab another bite of this delicious salad. I have eaten salad for five straight days, y'all. And I'm getting in my protein. What did I eat last night? Oh, y'all, last night for dinner, I was like, what can I get? I was so tired from work. So I got stopped by and got roses. And y'all, you know, usually I get the one with that's not good for you. So I ordered the taco salad and didn't eat the bowl that it was in. And I got black beans instead of refried. So I had my lettuce, tomato, cheese, black beans, and meat. So it wasn't very big. I was still hungry after, but I'm trying to be good. So, okay. Let's see if this is going to be big enough. Mm, I think not. So let me grab another one. And if you can hear me chomping, I'm so sorry. Salad is so good. And it's really, my husband said, we got so many bags of salad mix. And I'm like, well, you know, because see what it is, is I'll buy. And then, ooh, I think I'll use this one. Look at this one, y'all. It's got pencils on it. So I'll buy it. And um, then, well, for a while, we would buy it and just kind of forget we bought it. And then it would go bad before we remember to use it. So... I tried so hard, I'm trying so hard to eat the salad mixes so we do not waste. Okay, got this, I'm gonna measure myself a little piece over here. I just wanna make sure it's gonna fit right up inside. And I can go all the way up in there like this. You don't even have to cut this yet. Put it all the way up inside your envelope and take your pencil, kind of draw the edge of the envelope like that. I'm gonna pull it out. Let me grab another bite, y'all. And I'm just gonna have to see cut this one. The tomatoes are so sweet. They're so good. Yep, I have salads for five straight days now. I'm just trying to eat more greens, but tonight it will be grilled chicken and it will be broccoli and salad again. I just need something substantial to fill me up. Okay. So now that I've cut that off, look, it's going to fit right up inside there just like that. So I'm going to add it to the, to the folder I'm making right now. 
and it's just going to go right over the top just like that and if i need to trim a little bit off i can do that so i'm going to trim let's just go about an eighth of an inch on this side just so I can see a little bit of the beautiful purple. And the nice thing about using these colored envelopes like this, which I think I probably got them like at Hobby Lobby a long time ago. But the nice thing is, is I don't have to matte this because it's already a beautiful color. So now all you're gonna do is you're gonna glue it on. I can feel the arthritis in my wrist, y'all. If you have arthritis, I know you can relate. I mainly have it in my hip, but um, it comes up in this wrist sometime, too. And I sure do feel it when I'm crafting sometimes. Okay, I'm going to pull this up just a tad. I want to make sure that this is going to be even. Okay, and look already. It's already different colors. You could have did the same color up inside here, but I want to be different. And uh, there's the inside of our folder. On the outside, sorry for my arm, y'all. We're going to do this one. Isn't that so cute? Oh, my goodness. So I'm going to do this on the outside, and I won't even need to mat it because it's already purple. And I just cut it where it's a little bit smaller than the size of my envelope. So I'm just going to glue this one on. You can mass produce. You can just make yourself up a bunch of folders. And then once you're done, you can put it together and make yourself a nice album out of them. So you sound like a journal. Whatever you want to do. It could be great flat mail. This would be an absolute wonderful flat mail. Okay, I'm going to try to get this in the center. It's already now becoming very sturdy. Look at that. So cute. Look at that. That's so cute, y'all. So now we've got this. Now look at the inside. Now we're going to put a piece on the back. And see, by me using the same color, at least it all blends in together. It's time for a bite, y'all. It's very good. I love cucumbers. My husband, he hates them. He said, I don't like cucumbers. I'm like, they taste delicious to me. Let's go with this. I could do that, or I could do this. Let me see what. Hmm. It doesn't really matter, but I am going to cut my paper so I don't waste. I'm going to measure it off, just leaving a little edge. And I'm going to trim. Be simple, y'all. Take your envelopes and make yourself some nice folders. Great for flat mail. So I'm going to cut this one. And I think, I think for this one, I'm going to use the polka dots. It's super pretty. I love it. So, got a little paper right there to get it off. I don't know. This is gorgeous, too. I don't know, y'all. Ah, so hard. Well, you know what I could do is I could make another one with the pink. So maybe I'll do this side. Okay. I thought a while ago, I should go out and walk. And um, this is too hot. Probably, probably 95 degrees out. I think I they said on Labor Day it's supposed to be cooler. I am grateful we have to go to that parade, but the parade is going to be early, so. Okay, got that one covered. So now, look, we have ourselves a sweet pocket folder. Got two pockets there. I'm going to add the sweet little cut apart that I got out of this collection on the front. You can put it down here, you can put it in the center. I think for this one I'll do the center. And I'm just going to add glue. Put it in the middle. So 
cute. Look at that. Isn't that so cute? I love the paper. The paper is darling. Okay, we don't want to over decorate because it's pretty busy up inside. But I'm going to use some of the stickers. And um, got to get another bite, y'all. It just helped to have a little bit of the ham in there just to kind of give me a little bit of something. And it really made it good. So delicious. Okay. So, sorry for my crunching. I've got this one here. I think I'll use this on the edge. If it'll fit. No, it doesn't. It's not enough. Let's use another one. Got a little pink. Let's go for it. And I'm going to add it right up this edge. And I'm going to trim it off. That's cute. If you have enough, you can go around the edge of this too. But I don't have enough of that one. But I do, since I did one side with trim, I think I'll use, the, uh, use some more trim on the other side. So maybe I'll go with, uh, let's go with this one. This one going up the other side. And you can put so much stuff inside your little em your uh, pocket folders here. You made a very cute pocket folder. Okay, I'm going to save this dress because I can use it on something else. And then I think I need a little bit of uh, happiness going on. So this one right here, you color my world. Let me see how this would actually look. Yeah, that's very cute. Very, very cute. I do think it needs to be layered up on something though. Let me see if I got a scrap over here. I do have a scrap of purple right here. That was part of the envelope. So I'm just gonna, just gonna use that. I'm gonna cut it. Okay, I'm going to try just to give it a little bit of border. I just got a fussy cut it <sighs> the best I can. I'm hoping that tomorrow when we go to Canton that I can find some kind of vintage like uh, little golden books. Because I still have little golden books I want to make for the craft fair. Y'all, do you realize that Christmas is coming very soon? Okay, layered that up. I'm just going to add this one down here. I don't want to do too much because I think that, um, you know, whatever you put in it, it's going to make it too bulky if you add too, too much. But you curl in my world. That's so cute. I'm going to grab a bite of my mater. I love tomatoes. Okay. Now that I put that, I should put something on the other side. Mm -hmm. I'm going to check out the cut apart. There's some pretty cute little ones in here. Look at these. So cute. How about this one? I love crafting. I'm just going to fussy cut this one. Hope you're still with me. I know decorating part or adding pretty things on it can be a little time consuming. So I hope that you are with me still. It's cute. Move this out of the way. 
So over here on this side, I'm gonna see if I have enough for it to layer this one up. Not that piece. I could use another envelope. Why not? So I'm gonna just use this blue and I'll glue this one on. Don't y'all love the back? It's got the cut parts on it though. I don't know why they do that. It's so beautiful. They always put the beautiful as paper on the back. If you guys are YouTubers, this is my question for you. If you're a YouTuber and you're doing your crafts or whatever you do, do you feel kind of weird just sitting in a house all by yourself talking like you're talking to yourself like I'm doing with you? Because uh, it, why I talk to you and it makes me feel like you're really, really there. Okay, because I used an envelope, I better stick a little glue just up in here just so it'll stay. Okay, let's stick this one over here. That's cute. So how cute is this little pocket folder? Oh my goodness, y'all. So I'm gonna make some more. Now on this one, as you see, I added a little pocket across the front, but for this one, I wanted to use this cut apart on the front. So, but this one is a little bit different. I didn't decorate all the, the edges yet, but look, we can add a cut apart on these two. Let's do that really fast. And so the stuff is just, this collection is just so cute. Oh my goodness. Um, I'm trying to see what I would want on this one. I think that I will, let's just go with this one. Eat, sleep, craft, repeat. Ooh, my husband is probably so excited because He's off for a couple of days. He's got to go back to work next Friday, but he's off for a couple of days. And so I know that he's going to be, he will be very, very excited when it comes five o'clock today. So he can have a little time off as well. It's much deserved, much needed, much, much needed. Okay. I'm going to add a little bit of this trim here. I got another one here and I might do it. I might. I think this one will look good over here. So I'm gonna do this one. Use up your paper, y'all. If you're if you're anything like me, you have been hanging on to it. It's time for us to use our paper and just have fun. I'm gonna add that on there. I think that's cute. And then I'm going to have to layer this one up. Let's see if I have enough of this envelope left. And I do. I might have to stop crafting for just a little bit after this. And take some Tylenol for this uh, hand of mine. Okay. Just because I can feel it. Or maybe just take Tylenol and keep crafting. Oh, that could be a better idea. Just so I can... Uh, have my arthritis decide to be my friend today and not my enemy. Okay, that's cute. So I'm going to put this one over here, eat, sleep, craft, repeat, or you can put it in the center. I think it's cute. I'm just going to put it there. And I'm going to put it right over here. See it here. It's really hard to go to the grocery store and buy buy foods that you would love to eat. And you know, yeah, that stuff is good, but that's why it's not good for you. So it was really hard, but I'm glad I make the decision. Okay, 
So there's that side of this one. This is so stinking cute. And then I need to do a little bit on this side as well. So I've only got this one left. Let's get this one off and see what we can if we can use it for this one. got a little little they gotta get these little stickers out of the holes so I can use this one I'm hoping if it'll just pop right out for me so I'm trying to be careful because this is actually pretty delicate y'all I hope that you're having a great Saturday I am I am having a very good Saturday I feel I feel good just to you know what I think I'm just so excited just to have a few days off of work I'm very excited about just not having to go to work this week I do feel a little sad that my coworkers are going to be having to take all the calls from the storms and doing all that. But, you know, I've had my vacation time planned for quite a little while. So I'm just going to enjoy it and spend time with my husband, get in a little crafting ever so often. Okay, I got one more to pop out here. And I'm just going to enjoy it. See my family see my kids okay I'm excited about that okay let's put that over there and now let's see if I can get these off my fingers really fast these are very crafty folders y'all so I think that that's what I should call them crafty pocket folders I don't know what I'm gonna call them I just made it up I think I've made something like this similar in the past, but I didn't just make them as folders, you know, so. Okay, let's get that pressed down. Now we're gonna need a little something over here. So let me grab my little, my trusty little sheet here. Sorry for my squeaky chair. I think I'm gonna ask for a chair for my for Christmas from my husband. It don't even have to be an expensive one. It could be a just an inexpensive one that doesn't squeak. Okay. Need something right here. Um, I kind of like this. Hello. I'll put it up here. Don't have to overdo. Just super simple. How cute are these little pocket folders? And now I have two. So like this one. All I did was add like a two inch strip, measured it across, glued the edges and the bottom on, and now I have a pocket. So if you're making some kind of journal or something like that, or even if it's flat mail, you have extra places to tuck things. So yeah, that's it y'all. I hope you like this. I hope you like this. I hope you'll pull out your envelopes. I hope you'll give this a try. Make some fun little pocket folders. And that way you can use this flat mail, use in your journals, use in your albums, whatever you want to use it for, y'all. It's just fun. And it's, it's time for us to pull out our stuff and just use it. That's what we need to do. And how cute is this? Anyway, thanks so much for stopping by. Well, my lunch time. I'm going to finish up my salad and I will talk to you guys soon. I love you guys. Bye.